Hello YouTube fans and welcome to another video from Crimbo 007 Right, in my last YouTube video we've done the unboxing and the review of the U8 smartwatch if you can remember a little nice baby not bad for the price of £18.69 which was a great bargain. Now, that was that YouTube video all done with and dusted. But now, we have now going to do a new, brand new YouTube vid. And it's going to be a brand new unboxing vid of my new smartwatch. Yeah, you may probably thinking, another smartwatch? Ooh, let's have a look. And no, it's not another U8 smartwatch, which I do admit is quite really good for its price. And it is really good in design and it's really comfortable when you wear it. But the U8 smartwatch was not what it was cracked up to be because I did pair it with the iPhone 5S. Now with Apple products, Apple don't like you using their products. So that's why half the features on the U8 smartwatch don't work. Like for instance, if you send a, if you receive a text message on your iPhone, you can't read it on the smartwatch, which I might have said in the previous YouTube vid. So I do apologise if I said that you could read and send text messages via your U8 smartwatch, which is absolutely not correct. Um, yeah, basically this smartwatch uh, for uh, also another example, it's got uh, Bluetooth notice. And it's got Bluetooth camera, which is not also is not compatible with iPhone. No, but they are compatible, and they do work if you have an Android phone. So basically, if you do have an Android phone, then these watches are pretty good. But don't get me wrong; I will admit you can make and receive phone calls. So basically, the smartwatch, the U8 smartwatch, is good in that way, and the sound quality is pretty decent. For, for, yeah, the speakers up there, and the sound quality is pretty good. So don't get me wrong, the U8 smartwatch is a pretty decent, decent smartwatch for the price. And like I said, Apple don't like you using their products. So that's why half the features, like, uh, uh, like uh, the camera, uh, BT notice, and uh, messaging doesn't work. But if you've got an Android phone, then they will work on an Android phone. But like I said, don't get me wrong, they are pretty decent smartwatches for the price. Now, we're going to do an unboxing vid of my new, brand new smartwatch. Yes, I've got a brand new smartwatch. And, when you look at it, you're going to think, bloody hell, he's got an Apple Watch. But then again, this is not an Apple Watch. But, it comes very close to an Apple Watch. So here we go, unveiling my brand new smartwatch and there you go as it says on the box smartwatch as it's got on the front a smartwatch and yes it does look like the apple watch but trust me this is not an apple watch i actually got this from ebay and this smartwatch was a little bit more expensive than the u8 smartwatch but this smartwatch 
cost me £45 with free postage and packaging. Yep, this smartwatch, £45, free postage and packaging. And yes, they do work with the iPhone 5S, the iPhone 5C, the iPhone 5, the 6 and the 6 Plus. And I do believe they do work with previous versions of the iPhone if they are Bluetooth compatible. So there you go. That is oops. That is the iPhone and that is the smartwatch. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do an unboxing video and see what the smart watch looks like and is it really an Apple watch well trust me this is not an Apple watch but it does look exactly the same so really it could be a twin so let's all right here we go as you can see it's a plain box got a uh, bit of a uh, Japanese writing there and uh, it's also got uh, all your functions and what it does on the box right here we go and there you go one Apple Watch unboxed and yes it does look like a Apple Watch and if I did the Apple Watch previously, this is not an Apple Watch, but it does look like an Apple Watch. So, what do we get? We get the box, we get the smart watch, and inside the box, you get the USB lead to connect to the smart watch. And if you open the box in a bit more detailed, take the box apart, you should also get a little book to tell you how the smartwatch works. And also, if you've got it on your iPhone, you can download the barcode and you can see, there you go. So you got your in you got your Japanese Chinese version that side and you got your It's fifteen hours. Thank you very much. That's my clock telling me it's three o'clock, which will virtually be correct. Alright, as I was saying, uh you got your English version now of how the smartwatch works. So basically, all you have to do is download the scanner on your iPhone, which is that, which is a uh, barcode scanner that. Don't know if you can see that, but that's the scanner, and you just scan that there to activate all the features on your smart watch. So basically, that's the instruction book. And let's have a look at the smart watch. And now as I, as you can gather, it does look like an Apple watch, but no, this is not an Apple watch. This is just a basic, Bluetooth International Smartwatch. As you can see there. So, yeah, that is the smartwatch. So, yeah, and in my next YouTube video, I will be pairing it up with the iPhone 5S. 
So thank for watching. Quimbo 007. Introducing my new smartwatch, which looks like the Apple Watch, but it's not the Apple Watch. As I said, this was £45 on eBay with free posting and packaging. So, yeah. But don't get me wrong, the U8 smartwatch is still a decent phone for its price. But, like I said, there you go. Thanks for watching Quimbo007 on YouTube. Catch you later. Thanks for watching.